today we've got squats. And all I'm telling you is I'm going every the math session. That's all you get to know. You've got to watch the rest of the video if you want to see what I do. No, I'm not going to spill any. Say you get a squat PV. You ready? <laughs> oh, is it my? <laughs> right. Yeah, we're squatting anyway. Josh is deadlifted because he's a savage. Oh. I think there was a bit more in that than I thought. <laughs> what a mess. Like, on a Sunday sometimes I'll only get one meal in. Yeah. Whereas I've had three big meals today. That's why I look so, uh, so sexy. What are you going up to? Come on, Josh. Thank you. 
YouTube, get the oil out. Hit 20,000 subs, I'll oil him up for you. No, I won't. <laughs> I'll do it for free. Pulled it easier than he did, yeah. That's why I say, like, maybe if we stuck with Tuesdays, I can bench on a Sunday and I could train like Thursday or Friday in the day, my light day. It doesn't matter if I'm here with, with anyone or not. Saying like you train Friday anyway, don't you? So. But all's in. Closing. I had a cardio in my garage for weeks. And I went in, I was on the phone when I did it. So I started, I was like. <laughs> <laughs> but I put five kilos on since I last did, didn't it? But I don't cut these sessions short anymore. That's the old me. That's why I was a fat mess.
If it's not effing, it's burping. Yeah. <laughs> Go on, mate. Easy. Just getting started. Let's go. Come on. Yes. Nice. One more, mate. Come on. Last set. Tell me you're a big sexy <laughs> Alright. Okay. Yeah. Gorgeous! Big set now! Come on, mate! Power! Yes! Easy! Come on, you big sexy c Let's go! F lovely! Wow. Yes! Good effort. Beautiful. Best f***ing Ah! Yes! Yeah, well, I'm locked in. You're locked in, I'll do get you out. <laughs> you pull them on that. Yeah, bud. Yeah, good. Nice one. Oh, well, you put some effort in on that last set. <laughs> There's only one thing in, in this. Take two. Take two. I was saying there's only one thing I'm interested in pulling this year, and that's 505. No women. I'm a monk. Yeah, I've got two eight singles, I forgot about To be fair, mate, I don't think you need two extra reps, you don't need to do it. That's my opinion anyway. I mean, that's 400, that's 390. But I was well into my peak here. Yeah. Just, just the speeds. You can tell the, the lockout's so much cleaner, isn't it? Yeah, yeah.
I think I cooled down a bit too much here. <laughs> Been yapping for about half an hour. Come on, Josh. <laughs> Make this the easiest 280 you've ever done. Come on! Lovely. Beauty. Beauty. What did I say about not bleeding? Every session is blood. I'm very happy with my squat. <clears throat> Just because of the way Easter's worked, I was a bit concerned because I did my light squat session just two days ago. So, not the most ideal, but it's kind of the way that, that life works out sometimes with kids, with work. So, it hopefully will happen again now. Um, things will be nicely spaced out. But I definitely felt I had five in me, which, which is great, which means my squatting is the strongest it's been. So uh, I'm maintaining position well. I'm quite excited to see what I deadlift next week. I haven't got any numbers in mind yet. Probably 400 for three or five. Two, three, two, three. Yeah. We'll see on there. If I pull free and it's easy, I'll do another set, don't I? You know what I'm like. But I'm, I'm excited to see how it is because I haven't been fresh, fresh on these big days for a couple of weeks now and I'm still still getting in, still getting the numbers up. Um, so it's still quite impressive. Um, but yeah, hopefully I'll come in a bit fresher next week from a deadlift and we'll see if it's any different to having a slug a gym move around for three days. But. In theory, it should be, but sometimes these things are a bit unexplained. How far out are you now from? Five months. Five months. It's a long time. Mm. Plenty of time to like back off and. Yeah, I'm in a you know, good spot. Yeah, very like physically, I'm in a great spot. So, you know, like I'm, I'm way, I'm way ahead. Because I was saying this to Pa. Um, we were at Worlds, do you remember, late April last year? Was it end of April? Yeah. So I wasn't even considering 505 this time last year. No. It wasn't even a consideration. And then when we were at Worlds and we were having a beer, it was Colin that said something to me and it, it, it enticed me to go and have a go at it. So we went and pulled that 410, didn't I? It was quite hard. And then I came back and started my prep in May. So like we're only starting April. And yeah, it's wild really. So just gotta keep looking after myself, that's the main thing. Uh, which I think I'm doing a good job of. So. Like surely it's only gonna get easier, isn't it? Like looking after yourself. Yeah, I think so, from a, from a mental perspective, yeah. I think 
I think the mental aspect is going to get easier for me. You know, it's been quite a rough few months. I've got through it and I'm still lifting this shit, so hopefully I just get better. You know, I, I think I'll, well, in the next two deadlift sessions, I'll probably pull 420 for three, which is, you know, I need to slow down really, I guess. But if it's easy, if it's still RPE like eight, then I'm still training within my boundaries and I can still crack on. I just don't want to be like pulling a third rep where it's grinding. Yeah. Because then it's like, right, now I need to back off. And I always want to just train within my boundaries and hopefully my boundaries just keep moving. Yeah. You know, like in my head I thought this would be a max three, but it turned out it wasn't. So it's great again, an hour four in two weeks. And you, even you said, what's the next one? Yeah, I think, I think that's a good, like what we worked at today is a good level to work at. Because like if there was like a few more people in, oh, put some more plates up. Yeah, that yeah, yeah. session had a bit like, oh, that, that last 250 set was good, I'll put 300 up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then end up by smoking myself for a few days. Yeah. Doing the session at 78% effort. And then, like, that's the key, that is the key. So then I'm not smoked all the time. Patience is the number one, the number one trait that I f try and tell people. <clears throat> That's why it takes me an hour to do three sets of good morning. <laughs> Come on. Won't be a gym without it. That is a wrap. Oh, very happy with the session. Um, for a change, 
I had my doubts about today's session, like I said earlier, just because of training two days ago. But a brilliant session. Strength is, is really good. Body's feeling really good. Um, onwards and upwards. I might, I don't know. I mean, a lot of people have asked me about deloads. When, when do you think you're going to deload? I'll deload when I come in and these sessions are like borderline not doable. That's probably when I'll have a deload. But everything's going really well. Like, wasn't a max three. And uh, the whole concept behind that really is I've left the gym with a little bit more in the tank and that is the way to get stronger. Um, you know, if it was a max three, I'd have to then go away and work out what I was going to do in two weeks' time. But I know now, unless, you know, something drastic happens, I can go over here in two weeks' time. So, um, obviously I've stopped doing fives, started doing threes. But it's the same, you know, I'm doing threes and they have to be comfortable or borderline, can do more reps. Uh, and then just do my drop downs. So, my drop downs actually felt scaringly good today. 255 for fives, felt very, very easy. Um, went a bit light on the good mornings just because I was a bit toasted. But again, that they felt very, very light. Um, this felt heavy, but I'm tired now. I'm just gonna go do my usual hamstring curls, single leg, and then I'll do some sit-ups to finish. Uh, I'll save that for the only fans. But uh, thank you again, guys. I really appreciate everyone watching and watching this journey. Um, it's quite nice being back at the old gym. I feel like it's probably given me more of a kick than a, a hindrance. A bit of a fresh start, change the scenery. Uh, but yeah, there's going to be some crazy sh** in here soon, I think. So stay tuned, stay safe, and have a great week. Thank you, everybody.